Uh, hi guys, welcome back. And um, last time we were stuck because um, we couldn't figure out how to um, how to get rid of this error. And um, so I'm just gonna remove the template, and it magically goes away because uh, with templatized uh, parameters, there is one more step you have to do and it's it's not really easy and I don't want to go into it because it will waste a lot of time and uh, I have limited time so all I did here was change the vector to a vector int and still it equals vbegin it is not equal to vend and loop it or increment it so it as you remember by this picture will step through all these boom 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 whew. and so it will keep hopping along until it finds bob5 which is also bob end and then bob end and bob5 or that's the same thing so it will compare itself to bob5 say oh I'm the same and the loop will go bye bye so hope you understand that mm, metaphor oh. so uh, we have a print ve vector function and uh, to test if it works we'll just rerun the same exact program and uh, ta-da here it goes 5923 uh wow i'm my brain's glitching 5932 um so our vector is now 5932 right and uh, we'll take out these things the insert function and the iterator functions because we don't need them for now. We'll keep the iter and just to let you know there's also a const iterator uh, which means you won't change the uh, the vector. So a const iter iterator is useful for looping, for printing, for I don't know what, a lot of things. And there's also a, what's called reverse iterator. Reverse iterator and we'll call it r iter. And so if we want to, we can pass um, our, our iter will uh, do the, the exact opposite. So if you want to, okay, I'll change this back to a const iterator. And uh, so if we change this to a reverse iterator, and this is, this becomes our begin, this becomes our end, then guess what happens to our vector? <gasps> magic! It becomes magically reversed. 2, 3, 5. Right? Because the 9 is not there anymore. <gasps> it just ba magically became reversed because I used the reverse iterator. Logically speaking, that's pretty silly, but I mean, it's pretty obvious. But it's cool nonetheless. So, we have, you've gone end, um oh we don't even need the constant iterator and it becomes five three two because I made it be five three two Wow And so another cool thing we can have is we can say const um oops um vector of int uh iterator it equals v dot begin yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, vector begin, and then, oops. Let's call this beg. Let's call this n equals v dot end. Yep. So now we have beg and end, and let's do a quick syntax check. Oops. Here we go. And since we have this. And now, do, 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 do. okay, done. So we pass sort of beg and end and n. So we pass the beginning iterator and the end iterator. And now, hopefully, it will sort them. Except let's push back some more things um, because this is not enough to get a nice view of the sorted vector. 99 
135. Okay. And let's look at our how our sort works. Look at that. It's sorted all the elements. <gasps> magic. This is magic. C++ magic. <gasps> Anyways. So, uh, the sort is actually is not part of the vector class. It's uh, it's a standard template library uh, algorithm that can be applied to any standard template library object uh, vector uh, list uh, la 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 for oops for a bigger reference of these objects you can go to c++.com reference algorithm sort uh, al reference algorithm and it tells you all of the all of the uh, algorithms that are here binary search merge min min element mismatch replace remove copy replace set difference set intersection set union swap transform unique upper bound reverse reverse copy la 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 partition pop heap there's huge ex lexicographical compare you can't live without that one i'm telling you you can't live without that one anyways there's huge numbers of stl algorithms and um let's see what I, what else haven't we covered empty reserve what reserve is pretty simple uh, v dot reserve um, 10 reserve spaces for 10 integers so that you can put 10 integers in there so it won't because a vector behind the scenes does dynamic memory allocation it grows and shrinks like based on what what you put in there so if you want to say that I'm gonna use 10 and you don't want it to grow every single time you push push something back you say I reserve space for 10 elements but they're not initialized so they're kept as they are so it it's different from v dot um, uh, vector int v25 because this reserves it and initializes them to zero the reserve the reserve function is only reserve the space uh, let's see what else haven't we covered access uh, access of operators you can also say instead of um, well instead of this you can also access elements instead of the at notation v dot at uh, at five you can also use v dash five just like array notation but it's not bounds checked so it's a little a little more mm, I, I recommend using v dot at five rather than the other one let's see um, back at front uh, those are all pointers so um, resize capacity capacity tells you the capacity of the vector um, size max size gives you the the maximum size and size respectively of the vector let's see empty you can say um, if v dot empty um, do something here something here if it's a vector emper, uh, a vector emper. V empty vector you can do something uh, begin and r begin so r begin reverse beginning we, we did that operator equals you can say if you have v1 and v2 um, vector into v vector int v2 you can say after all of this you can say v2 is equal to v1 and then v2 oops equal to v and then v2 will be a clone of v1 it's a basically a copy constructor um, let's see that's pretty much it push back pop back we, we did those insert erase erase you can pass um, also and you can erase elements um, swap contents clear clear clears the vector and it's pretty useful and that's pretty much it um, so take care and use vectors to your advantage and hopefully next time we'll cover something uh, perhaps more interesting perhaps less I don't know but next time I'll, I'll see you uh, again and we'll do some other standard template template container perhaps have fun take care